Well, we have some shocking video today of a top Planned Parenthood director admitting on film to selling the hearts, livers, and skulls of dead babies. Now, this shocking footage was actually hidden camera video out of Los Angeles. Uh, it's part one of a three-part documentary series from the Center for Medical Progress. And this footage features a Planned Parenthood clinician discussing the practice of selling the body parts of aborted babies, a blatant violation of federal law. And uh, so this is a Dr. Deborah Nukatola, and she is the Senior Director of Medical Services at Planned Parenthood. So she's not just some rogue agent out here selling these baby body parts. This is top-down demonic savagery. And you look in this video and you see just how calmly and nonchalantly she is talking with these two um, undercover uh, actors here. It was a male and female couple, and she's basically explaining to them over lunch how the procedure goes down and which human organs are most popular. A lot of people want to attack parts these days because they're looking for specific nodes, A, B nodes, S, A. I was like, wow, I, I didn't even know. Good for them. Yesterday was the first time she said people wanted lungs. I uh -huh. um, And then, she, but like I said, always as many intact livers as possible. People just want Yeah, them. livers. People want lower extremities too, which that's, that's simple. I mean, that's easy. I don't know what they're doing with it. I guess they want muscle. But yeah, a dime a dozen. Some people will actually try to change the uh, presentation so that's not vertex, so it's a vertex presentation. You never have enough dilation in the beginning unless you have a real huge amount of dilation to deliver an intact calvarium. So if you do it starting from the breach presentation, there's dilation that happens as the case goes on and often the last you can evacuate the intact cell. Mm -hmm. So I mean there are certainly steps that can be taken. So they can to convert to, to breach, sure. for example, exactly. at the start of the exactly. They can under under ultrasound guidance they can just change the little bit of the presentation. Under ultrasound guidance, they can just change the little bit of the presentation. To bring the body cavity up, exactly. all that. So if you do it starting from the breach presentation, there's dilation that happens as the case goes on, and often the last you can evacuate the intact cells. Mm -hmm. So you see in the video there that the doctor is fully aware that the selling off of mutilated dead baby parts is effectively in violation of a federal law. That law prohibits the sale of fetal tissue procured from partial birth abortions. So this is absolutely disgusting. But the response from some in the mainstream media has been, how dare you try to humanize the procuring of, of tissue and things like that. If you actually go to the Planned Parenthood Twitter, they're like, this is just preposterous. The right wing, they're editing this video and making up stories. And then take a look at the angle that The Hill went with. They say, GOP seizes on video of Planned Parenthood exec discussing transfer of aborted fetal issue. So that's their tweet, and of course, everyone is like, that's the angle you're going with? This is absolutely disgusting and horrendous. You call yourself journalists. Take a look at some of these tweets. Uh, they say, when media finally gets around to this Planned Parenthood story, it'll be a framed as an attack on the organization. Bingo, nailed it with that tweet. And then they say, if you can't defend Planned Parenthood harvesting organs, make the story about the Republicans seizing on it. You're, so you're starting to see how they spin these stories. Uh, this one from Matt O'Brien, he says, GOP seizes on, not PP director seen admitting to multiple felonies and to selling fetal organs for profit. And then uh, the last one here, D.W. Robison, breaking, credible news outlet purposefully obfuscates secret human organ market with political BS. 
And that's exactly what is happening here. They're not focused on the federal laws that are being broken or the inhumane savagery of this woman sipping her Chianti, talking about harvesting organs from partial birth abortions, uh, which you see in the video there. I mean, if, if the child is alive at the time and if any other actions are taken at that point to end its life, that is homicide. And so here this lady's admitting, you know, that that's how they're going to get these organs and sell them. So it's this huge business. And uh, it's that is the sickening truth about Planned Parenthood. It's something we've been trying to get across to people. And, you know, the girls, they come to our uh, events and brag about how they kill their kids. And they're just so excited about that.